Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Myself Sultan, an expert digital marketer. I am expert in Google Ads, Facebook Ads, Google Analytics, Google Tag Manager, Facebook Pixel Conversion API Server Side Tracking. Today I am going to show you in this video how to enable data there in your WordPress website. If you want to enable data there um, easily, you can try. Uh, you can try it with a plugin. On WordPress site so this is my tag manager Google tag manager and this is my shop website and it's backend so at first I'm going to show you and show you that there is no data layer enabled in my website so let's go to preview mode on preview mode uh, we can uh, connect it it's coming in preview mode now we will see that there is uh, empty data layer in Google Tag Manager uh, tag is written connected and now we will see a product base um, please tap here continue and then see there are some options tags variables data layer consent errors data layer if we go to data layer then there are a few data we came uh, a few data uh, we are in a product page hand sanitizer see here hand sanitizer and here uh, when we go to data layer see there are a few data uh, came from website uh, if you want to set up enhanced e-commerce tracking on your website then you have to you must have so many data from your website and and the, the, that data uh, you have to uh, in that data layer you have to enable according to j4 google analytics 4 google analytics 4 gave us a data layer schema if we search on a new tab j4 data layer schema for data layer schema okay go Google Analytics for properties. Here it gives us if you want to uh, if you want to uh, view item uh, event track, then you have to uh, put this data layer schema on your website, and that calls data layer schema and now uh, since there is no data layer in my website enabled I am going to enable it easily so go to your uh, website backend and go to plugin uh, other, on the other hand we can go to also settings google tag manager google tag manager it's a plugin on a wordpress website that called uh, ZTM for WP. When we add this plugin to our website, we can enable data layer very easily. Very easily. And then go to integration and then go to WooCommerce. Here we go. See here track enhanced e-commerce you have to check it 
okay we checked it and then save changes here we go it's complete and we have we will go in preview mode again okay it's completing okay it's complete and refresh your website then go to tag manager preview mode again okay connect it's connecting here we will see debugger connected debugger connected and continue it and then now we should go to a um, uh, product page and this is our product page and go to data layers now view item see here we got so many data from our website here so if you want to enhance uh, data layer enhanced e-commerce tracking setup on your website then you can take data from here and uh, set up in your uh, enhanced e-commerce tracking so that's it uh, I, I have showed you then how to enable data layer on your WordPress website so uh, today and that's it today we will see an another video if you need any help for Google Ads and Facebook Ads Facebook pixel Google Analytics Google Tech Manager server side tracking Facebook conversion API setup etc then please contact me add my contact info in the description so please if this video is beneficial for you then please like my video subscribe my channel and uh, all the best goodbye